steps are being taken to prevent ATM card skimming. The NBI is closely coordinating with banks to put an end to such illegal activities. This report. The National Bureau of Investigation is in talks with different banks to stop the ATM card skimming scheme. NBI Director Virgilio Mendez has tasked NBI Cybercrime Division Chief Donald Aguto to find out who the people are behind the scheme. I will just uh, instruct them to focus and give more attention on these uh, incidents. Now. Anyway, we will give you more details about this soon. Based on the NBI Cybercrime Division's latest reports, there is a possibility that a syndicate is behind the modus operandi. Since the scheme requires the acquisition of personal information, it is likely that professionals are behind the operation. There are ways in which the perpetrators can receive information without the need to return to the ATM machine. Possible ways to steal information include adding a card reader that scans for information and placing a a camera on top of the keypad to get the PIN code. This past week, banks were also able to find a wireless connection that sends information to a remote area. After acquiring all the necessary information, the suspect can now withdraw money from any ATM device. There are also reports of people that only use cards inside convenience stores and hotels. The first reported card skimming incident was at a bank inside a mall in Makati City. The NBI reminds the public to watch out for fake card readers and bogus pin pad overlays when using ATM machines. It is also good practice to cover your hand when typing your pin code. For the Christmas season, the NBI director has this reminder. The public should be wary about this. Na, dapat kung magpunta sila dun sa mga ATM outlet, dapat titingnan nila kung wala bang nagbabanta at saka may mga additional na mga gadget na nilalagay dun. Those are the signs na Merong, merong, there's something wrong with uh, the DTM outlet.